Let's start off the news with the People's Democratic Party, PDP, and its presidential candidate, Atiku Abubakar, who have indicated plans to call no more than 100 witnesses if the presidential election petitions can't be EPC. Atiku had filed a joint petition before the presidential election petition court in Abuja to challenge the declaration of Bola Metinubu of the All Progressive Congress, APC, as the winner of the February 25 presidential poll. Atiku and the PDP had in a joint petition applied for the withdrawal of the certificate of return that was issued to Tinumbu by the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC. They maintained that the declaration of Tinumbu as the winner of the presidential election was invalid because of non-compliance with the provisions of the Electoral Act 2022. Addressing the court on Saturday, counsel for the petitioners Chris Uche said all the parties had met and considered and agreed on the number of witnesses, duration and examination of witnesses. We have almost come to the end of the pre-hearing session. The parties with loud streamlined the witnesses we are calling, the times allocated to each witness, the times we are going to use. And we are very happy with the progress that is being made and also the sacrifice that the court itself is making. You can see today is a Saturday, yet the court convened and sat in order to hear this matter which underscores its importance. So once we finish with this um, the hearing, we now go into the actual hearing. We are very happy with the progress made so far. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.